Hey everybody, welcome back to another one. So what you're about to watch is the other part of my LA trip, um, which was back in the last week of March, first week of April. That was a really, really fun trip. It really, really showed me that really, no matter where you go, if you enjoy fishing, there's places you can go no matter where you live to go to do some fishing, as long as you just get out there and go try. I will be back at the end to, to talk with you guys a little one-on-one -on -one real quick. So sit back, enjoy, and here you go. I'm at the third spot that I was really looking forward to going to. And the really cool part about this is, is that all three of the places that I'm going to or I've been, like 15 minutes from where I'm staying. So like this is right straight up downtown. So this is this is gonna be great. Uh, Condition's a little different. I think I'm gonna tie on a little lipless and see what we get. Stay tuned. All right, so we're gonna try something out. I am actually recording this one on my phone because my, I did not plan accordingly for the filming aspect of it, but we're gonna see if this works. So here we go. So, oh, fish, woo boy, yeah. Oh, this is a good one too, look at that. Look, this is a, holy cow. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Yes, stop. Y'all check that out right there. That is my first California bass. That is awesome. That's probably good two pounds. All right, I'm sticking with it. I am sticking with that spinnerbait because man, that was so much fun. All right, get this a little let go. Thank you so much. Let's go. That, that was awesome. Yes. All right, it's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be a good day. So I get on another one real quick. And again, Bass Pro, you uh, you did really good with this rod, cause that held up really nice, even with that flip. That was incredible. Try to get on another one real quick. So there's this pipe. I think it came right off that pipe. Boom. All right, sunglasses have to go down. Another one. No. All right, I actually gotta catch another one so I can get a picture to post on social media, post on Facebook and Instagram, because I need to start doing that. And I used to do that, but I didn't do that. Cast out by the big fish. See if I can get a big fish.
All right, I'm curious if there's something in this little canal right here. All right, so I'm making a small little change. Um, switching over to this mini clutch right here. Um, because if you've watched that one from when I was in Lafayette, this pond is kind of the same. And I said there, small pond, go small. So that's what we're gonna do. And this is that. Plus I can launch this thing out really, really far. And this is this color was called shotgun shed which i like for sunny days like this right now because it has some extra ooh, extra reflective stuff on the side to give it a little bit more shimmer so instead of going thump i'm trying to go noise and reflection oh we'll see if how it works Plus, with this being a medium rod, I can definitely lean into them a little bit more when they get hit. Oh, that's something out of fish. I think I'm hitting that pipe that's over there. So yeah, so that's the trip. Um, couple of thoughts about it um one it was really really fun um two i wish i had gone to that third place the um on the first day i got there would have had more time to really explore a little bit more than what i did but all in all it's a really really fun trip um all the fishing aside got to see a lot of good friends that weekend got to um spend time with with them out in Los Angeles even though we were working now for the part I want to talk with you guys about uh, I do want to say first off I want to say thank you so much for everyone who has um, watched my videos over the last couple of months I uh, greatly greatly appreciate it I am looking forward to seeing where this channel goes and looking forward to what the future holds secondly I am going to be doing some more trips like this um, I do have a trip planned for Michigan with a friend Adam uh, in June and then like we go from that to Wisconsin for a uh, actually our church's youth group retreat in Wisconsin which is on a beautiful lake and I will do I am close to getting to 100 subscribers um, that is a goal of mine I would love to see get I would love to be able to get to 100 subscribers um, by the end of May I think that would be awesome but I know it takes you guys in order to do that you as the viewer so I would like to ask please 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 um, if you have enjoyed any of these videos then please just then just subscribe um, that would help me just with the goals that I would like to do to see where this channel could go make sure you turn that note the bell notification on really just because not so you get notified when I do when a new video gets uploaded, but I am gonna start doing some giveaways. So you wanna make sure that you stay, get those notifications so you stay updated with anything like that. Uh, notifications, um, videos get uploaded, giveaways that I'm doing, uh, so you can kinda, of, you know, just stay in the loop. Speaking of giveaways, if you haven't already watched the last video that I posted with the Star Wars thing, uh, there is a giveaway in that one. And if you, if you have watched it, didn't watch it all the way through go back and watch it all the way through because there is a giveaway in that one and the instructions on how to be entered into that giveaway are in the are in that video again if you enjoyed this video please give it a like comment down below some other cities that you think would be really good to travel and do kind of do that to kind of do this 
whole urban thing with, like I did in Los Angeles. Well, I can just sort of start making a list. Actually, let's call it my travel bucket list um, of places to travel and go fish um, that I think would just be really fun. Um, but yeah, comment down below some other places, some other cities that you think would be pretty cool um, to go fishing at. And I can just add those to my bucket list and then hopefully in the future get to them. But also, like I said, please subscribe uh, and turn the bell notification on. So, with that said, thank you so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. And I'll catch you on the next one.